Hello and welcome, I'm the Emperor and I'm so glad you're here for some more Dungeons 4. We're gonna check out the skirmishes now that we've done the campaign in the playlist. Check that out if you haven't already. And we're gonna play Tumultuous Transport Skirmish Mission number 2. Heroes are sending a large number of shipments on their way. Stop them! That is our task. And I've asked the viewers on the YouTube and also on the Mastodon and consensus is I'm gonna upload my failures just as much as my successes. So at this very moment, I haven't played this map yet. We'll leave all on the default settings. I'm not gonna play hard. I'm a little bit burnt out thanks to the campaign. And sadly, there isn't really an achievement associated with playing everything on hard. So, you know, this is my free time as well, my weekend. So let's see. Uh, once we have completed this map, successfully we get the travel speed skill. So let's check it out, how we're gonna go about this. And most of my faction level is 10 everywhere. I'm gonna remove this and do we go for Horde or Demonic? Honestly, I, I do enjoy me some demons, so I think we're gonna push for demonic corruption and play with demons and traps and we'll see how that goes for us. Let's jump right in. Have you played the skirmishes? Let me know down in the comments. I wonder. I'm really impressed, I never said it, but I'm really impressed Tanya that a lot of players... The hero city. However, those good-for-nothing heroes had protected their city with an impenetrable mana shield. However, it's crazy. this shield consumed a lot of mana and had to be recharged again and again via mana shipments. If Tanya All could right. prevent the mana shipments from arriving, the shield would collapse and nothing would stand in the way of her conquering okay. or destroying the city. Alright, uh, what I'm really impressed with on Dungeons 4, quite honestly, is the completion rate. I think almost 25% of players who have this game actually completed it too. Which is fairly... There's a big number for a... I would say a pretty niche game like Dungeons 4. It is pretty niche. Yes. It has a very loyal following is what you can read from that. And I'm a little bit hesitant to get the Brimstone. But then again, might as well get the Brimstone early. Because it will inevitably kill the snot that digs into it. And better it kills low level snots a than high level snots. Unearthed in the dungeon. I think. It's always sad to see them die, but. Manivores have been discovered in your dungeon. Okay, let's see. Manivores discovered. Let's go with the demon starting line up here. And that was a mistake. How do I could get gold now? Okay, I think I think I just is there like... I think there's a gold chamber down here. Like a little... Auxiliary gold chamber. <laughs> oh god. That nearly... Like, my heart stopped for a second there. That would have been... <laughs> a terrible mistake. Alas. No terrible mistakes were made. Just slightly terrible mistakes. So there's a lot going on here. The mana wars are gorging themselves. Let's try and get that mana away from them. And we'll just leave it up here. So if the mana wars want to go there, they have to go up there and fight the little creatures. We need a bolt of evilness. And maybe we upgrade this. Okay, we need a lot of things. So let's start with a lot of things. Bolt of evilness go here. Let's speed these boys up a little bit. As we need money the most right now. Are you attacking the heart? No. We're just sniffing around it. Ah, we're at, in combat because Talia engages. Okay. They are attacking the dungeon art. We might be... In a very big heap of trouble because we actually cannot afford anything right now. And Talia is definitely gonna die. And I cannot afford 
And I cannot afford anything. Ideally, we don't let Talia die, but our demons are... You have lost a creature forever. We are very dead. We are very dead. Let me see if I can fix this. Oh, no. No, I can't get him! Oh. They are so fast! Okay, I think we're getting one now. Okay, no, we're not getting one. And these are mine. These are like the most expensive creatures I could possibly get early on. One of your creatures has died. Like this is terrible for every metric. Every single metric you could imagine. This is terrible. Your throne room is under attack. <laughs> no. Oh no, I didn't pick up my imp. Oh no. It's I thought I had. But I hadn't. Okay, the heart will have to take a few beatings. <laughs> oh god, this is terrible. We're playing aggro ping pong. A shipment of mana set out. This appeared to be a profitable target for the unscrupulous <laughs> evil. This is not at all how this is supposed to be done. <laughs> oh no! We're doing it! We're getting it done! Can she tank it? Absolute worst start you can imagine. And we didn't even have them high enough so they could get experience from it. It's um... Yep, yep, yep. This is horrible. This is really bad. <laughs> God. Okay, now. All right. Let's get this. Uh, let's get this show on the road. Oh, great! There's spiders coming. Good stuff. Very good stuff. Where do I even start? Worst start imaginable. I mean, it could have been worse. We could have lost the dungeon art. Don't do what I did. Just don't. And let's get all this mana and throw it down here. Talia apparently is our tank for the moment. Alright, okay. So should we get some infernals? I like succubi personally. I'm really torn on what to get here. Let's get gold things first. Things that just cost gold first. Uh, 
All right. So this we probably can open up a little bit further. Generally, you will need a bunch of chicken for your demon army. I am not sure if demon is, is the correct choice here. Yeah, I mean, the, the shipments, they will bring us evilness. So that's probably a good thing. But at the very moment, we can't really afford any of that. So that's a bad thing. <laughs> you might imagine. I haven't unlocked doors yet. Come on, give me enough gold to unlock doors. Oh god, okay, this is this is also looking bad. Okay, let's take care of that. Let's take care of that. Whole army. Whole army instantly. Okay, there's some gold, which is what I'm looking for. Definitely need something that can take care of... Let me think. We definitely need something that can take care of what? There was a thought there. I swear. I don't remember what though. Yeah, we'll, we'll need evilness. Somehow. We need a good source for evilness. These things are not going to be that. So should we just go upstairs, kill a few things? But we, yeah, we need something that can tank. That's where my thought process was going there. But we also need some money for payday. Which is for sure coming up. Hear the spiders right there. So do we go up or what? I think so. I'm a little bit scared because our army is really, really weak. Level one. Nothing going on. A gold vein is almost exhausted. So we got the attack move now, finally figured out. So we cannot let Talia die. Your dungeon is full of yogurt. Yogurt? What's this all about? There's absolutely no yogurt. Oh. Oh, it's supposed to be a funny illusion. I see. Very funny. I'm trying to pull them back as they die. No, not Talia! Oh god, thank god for the level up there. The knights do so much damage. The warriors, excuse me. And did we get any evilness out of it? Almost nothing. It was definitely not worth it. Okay, we can't fight like that. That's not an army what we're having here. That's just sadness. Succubus could be the right thing. They cost 300. We don't have a lot. I think we need to go Succubus just for the evilness that we don't have. Like, literally. Oh, I'm so scared to click these. You have no idea because getting this right early on. There's so many variables in there. Let's get us some succubi. Succubi. That'll immediately make us much stronger. Enemies are in the dungeon. Okay. Oh great! I forgot that we are running into enemies right there. <laughs> So we lost an in for no good reason. Let's put him down here. And let's open this chamber up a little bit more. And also let's work on this gold pile here.
Everyone needs a bit of a speed up now. And then let's get some doors on the heart. That's something that if you don't do it early, you're going to regret it so hard. I have many, many times. Okay, so what's what's coming here? Oh god. Oh no, they're attacking our good stuff. Let's go for the priestess first. Oh god, there's spiders there as well. Why are they not attacking their own thing? Why are they attacking my thing? Okay, we saved our stuff. Let's get some doors on here as well. Okay, very good. That worked out for us. And we're just gonna sell this treasure chamber here. And we'll help carry this around to the right place. And what will we build here? Something new, I'm sure, eventually. For now let's upgrade this place. We're fairly good on evilness. Quicker up. Both of these are good. Like, we need the next two levels. But we also need this. But that's only gold. So, we want to reduce the evilness required to resurrect our demons. That's basically what we definitely want. And we probably want some traps. Though those are very expensive. So, we'll try with a few. Just so we have something. On both sides. Okay. Now do we go back up? I feel like, yes. With the Sakibai, we're in a little bit better spot. I see golden shields. I don't like golden shields. That's not good. Okay, so the attack move is a little bit... I think I actually need to switch this around again. So in the options, you can scroll down all the way down here. And invert attack mode needs to be unapplied. So if I want them to attack move, I hold down right click. If I want them to just move, I do a regular right click. Ding dong, it's payday. Yeah, Sakubai are doing a lot of hard work here. We need to take care though that we don't overextend because Sakubai cooldown can literally kill us if we don't keep it in mind. Is there anything for us to get? That's uh. So we need to wait for this to be ready. We need Beguile, otherwise we don't have much of a chance here. I wouldn't say no, but definitely less of a chance. We should upgrade this so they can be level 3, I feel. Talia as well. This costs just gold, so we're gonna go with that. This costs also just gold, so we're gonna go with that. And this one we need to have Demon Resurrection speed cheaper. And now our ranged are gonna take care of their squishies. Okay, nice, 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 nice. 
There's some evilness coming in, but not much. Okay, there's a lot of towers, so picking... Picking demons was actually a good or option, choice. Let's get back home. So we can go out the other way. And... See about things from that perspective. Okay, let's get some more doors going, maybe. Like they, I still don't know exactly what the efficiency on the gold on chamber does, but... Deliver the volatile energy to its destination. Oh, no. If the energy hoarding evil <sighs> did not prevent it from doing so. Okay, uh, let's see. Can we afford some more succubi? We can. So let's see if we if we can't intercept this. Would be good for us. Would be very good for us. But they might be too strong. Increase range of imps? I'm thinking yes, but we have very little evilness, so probably not. Maybe it's just a shipment. Sometimes it's only a shipment. Without guards, that would be ideal. But I have a feeling it might not be. So we're just gonna wait here. Okay, well, actually we're not. Oh no. Will the door be enough? Will the doors be enough? Okay, we kind of have to. Okay, it's not just the shipment. I don't know what's going on with my army right now. Because no one is attacking anything. Okay, let's go back down. It's not too far, so I'm not gonna teleport just yet. So maybe the spiders and the enemies are gonna fight each other. There is a chance that will happen. Yep. So, you know, bad luck, good luck kind of working on each other. All of our creatures are down, so we're just gonna attack from the side here. Of course, we want to avoid losing anything in our dungeon because all these things cost money to replenish. So that's no good. Do we attack one of those? I think yes. Like right now, I don't have a way to force the enemies to go through here. So we definitely have to fight these. So let's clean up. Let's do a house cleaning. Get all those spiders done with. Costs only money, we do it. Um, we need this bath and this. 200 and 150. We need both. Really, we do. So let's get the mana vault in here first. Give it a door. Because we don't want any mana wars to just wander in there. And the bathroom will just build next to it. Like over here, maybe. That'll be the bath. That is a bit too big for a bath. This is fine. Okay. Succubus doesn't doesn't feel like she's part of that whole thing. And we can build this out a little bit further. 
There is a traveling okay, that's... salesman at the door who wants to speak to the One spider nest. Normally, a case for the torture chamber, but somehow Let's try the other there's one. a certain spiritual similarity between the two. A few mana balls have appeared in your dungeon. Where? Up there, okay. Of course, right next to our mana vault. Where else? Let's finish this up first. So the bath is obviously way too big. But that's okay. So we've cleaned up a bunch of spiders down here. That's nice. Nah, I'm still not happy with this, of course. I need to upgrade everything. Let's get all this. Nope, I didn't want to get the gobblers. I wanted the mana. Get it right there. It's funny, you can throw it in a different room all you want, but you can't throw it in the room where it belongs as long as the room is full. Like, it doesn't stack there. It always goes outside the door. I don't know. Let's survive the payday. And we have some enemies coming in. We need to in your reinforce this here. We need to have a little traps circuit for them. No, that's not going to be it. Okay, we're just going to attack them like from here. So they're going to have to turn around and walk through water to get to us. Okay, I definitely thought this would be close enough for them, but I was wrong. Just making sure our creatures are all safe there. Oh, that was good. That, that was worthwhile. Let's get that drop of evilness that these briars bring. And we'll go upstairs now, on the other end. A gold vein is almost exhausted. That's not good. We'll have to go some a exploratory digs. This appeared to oh. be a profitable target for the unscrupulous evil. Lovely. I could came just the right way for that. Okay, we need to find more gold then. I mean, there's gold here. We can just dig that out. Okay, one of our succubus is almost dead. But we have no beguile on cooldown. That's weird. Did they not beguile anyone in this battle? Okay, no, we don't want to fight. No, we don't want to. Okay, look at that. I can't right click through this. So if I accidentally click on this. Some of these choices in this game, I swear. So we're really only here for the evilness. We don't care so much about clearing the area. Payday. That's some good beguiling going on there. Nice. That worked well for us. Very good. Now we can clean this up. For no other reason than that we can. Let's see, so... Increases fire susceptibility. These are really important for us eventually. But I think I want some spell work going on. And... Can't afford these, can't afford these. Do we upgrade our succubi a little bit? Two meters is a lot for the succubi. We need the range definitely on both of these.
So here we're doing a lot worse now because we have no Beguile ready. Beguile is truly important for our demon army. So let's go get back down here and try and find some gold maybe somewhere. So following the lines usually helps, but you can hear the skittering already. Like there's there's going to be spiders there, but there's also gold at the end of this or a vein of diamonds. So we definitely need our creatures back home. Has been unearthed in the dungeon. Oh, that is unfortunate. That is all kinds of bad. Did I go there? No, they came through. Okay, we need to fight the dwarves. So we're gonna stop the exploring here right away. We have to take care of the dwarves first. So we're gonna get more, you guessed it, Succubi. <laughs> And we're gonna wait for our succubi to reset that thing. It's 50 seconds or so. Sadly, I don't think I can see it down here. Like, if I select her. Okay, I can see it here. So, half a minute, then we can start attacking the dwarves. That is very bad for us. But of course, dwarves always come with riches, so that's nice. And right now they are not too strong as as far. This far. I like that they dug right next to where the gold is. So we're just going to go dig this out. Get some of that gold in here. It's a little bit how we were supposed to be led to the dwarves, I think. Yeah, let's see. Where are we at? Okay, we're good. So we can go attack. Your little snots have dug up a spider. There are enemies in your dungeon. Okay, that's not a nest, but there's gold there. That's good. So we can take care of that at our leisure. Spiders down there that we just uncovered are unlikely to attack us. They might, but they're unlikely. Uh-oh. It's a little bit too much. Come on now. You need to find that door and attack it. So there are some gold enemies in there already. I think we're managing. Okay, nice. So, this is not good. Of course. <laughs> this is not good. I didn't hear them coming down. I, I must admit. I did not hear that. We definitely need this for the money. Let's see. Give our imps a little bit more range. I don't think that's that important. We need the snot faster and better. And let's upgrade this as well so Talia can up level up. Payday. Some more. And I think the very next thing for us is the spider nest here. Well, it's not a nest, but the spiders here are the next for us. The next target. Done fairly well on the dwarf stronghold here. The ambush planning evil quickly developed an interception strategy.
I mean, we should intercept it just for the evilness, but there's dwarves coming right now. So we're just gonna go here, pick up our snots. Just so they're safe. Build a little treasure chamber here. And give them the go on this. Build a little door. Okay, I think we took care of the dwarves. Let's push deeper into in the, into the dwarf kingdom because these will be a problem eventually. Might as well take care of them immediately. So we filter this down to low health creatures. So we can rescue them from combat, basically. Just put them a little bit on the back line. The heart is the important thing. However, they're what? so small you can't even see them. So once this is down, there's not gonna be any more dwarves spawning to attack us. Okay, we need to pull back completely. Because they just kind of started overwhelming us here a little bit. As we attacked the heart, all of them pulled in from all the surrounding things. And there's a lot of gold ones in there. And we were bunched up already, so the f the the flamethrowers of theirs, that's a big issue for us. 100 for more range. It doesn't help us down here. I think we're going to upgrade the traps. Hurts me a little bit. Because I'd rather go for the snot upgrade. Snot upgrade. Snot upgrade. So we're gonna wait until our demons are regenerated. And then we're gonna go attack these guys again. Like this is the army that's our problem here. Vein of diamonds is gonna be cute and nice. But not all that important. Nothing has come up here yet. Okay, let's try... Let's try and go for the caravan. I don't know. Oh, no, there's a there's a tower there. And I bet you there's, there's enemies in that tower. Around that tower. And we don't have the range upgrade yet. Okay, but if we, if we catch them here... Okay, there's an even worse tower. <laughs> Let's get that statue here. Okay, range upgrade means we should be able with our imps to just take this out without putting anyone else at risk. Okay. <laughs> this will take a while. We don't have enough imps at the moment. So let's set let's get some of these especially the undead because eventually we want the prison for some evilness generation. Right now I just want to get more creature slots so we can have more imps. It's not a well-balanced army, by any means. But if we use it well, you know. The main problem are the Sakibai cooldowns. And we can't fight both the defenders and this at the same time, I don't think. We'll try. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oh god, that's bad. Payday. So 
that succubus didn't survive. I need to save our imps quickly. Because if they die, we have no damage in our army. Let's kite a little bit. Definitely can't lose Talia. All right. I didn't think we would manage. I'm looking at our enemies in the dungeon. And I think we're going to teleport home. It's not ideal, but we're a little bit too far away to do anything sensible about these. So let's see. We can't do this upgrade yet. I'm thinking getting some gazers in here would be good. Infernals, they are too expensive. Let's get gazers and upgrade our traps. Can't afford any. Population limit. Okay. Right, so now we just wait for the succubus. Cool down a minute. are in the dungeon. Okay. Oh no 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 no. This is a portal. That's bad for us. All kinds of bad right now. Luckily they don't have any healers, so that helps us a bunch. I'll just put him to deal with the portal already. So we definitely need to go north and take care of that portal. Oh god, we need to take care of so, so many things. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, let's see what we can buy that only costs us money. Let's try that. We're gonna go here just to get more creature slots. Can't go up there. We'll buy us a gazer. This costs a little bit evilness. Everything here costs us a little bit of evilness. Complex traps. I don't like them, I must say. They don't really ever do enough for me to justify the cost. I think another succubus would be good. So now we have a decent sized army here. I don't think the minute has been up for the succubus. Might be. Okay. Let's try the heart again. I'm so happy that dwarves don't have healers because honestly they are so tanky which makes sense that dwarves, dwarves should be tanky but it just makes my life so much more difficult I wish I knew which ones I already picked up. Like, that, that I can't really tell from this. We're not gonna pull back this time. We might lose a few, but... We're getting the heart this time around. And the dwarves are gonna go back in their chamber, so... We want to get that evilness here. That's what we came for. Right there. That's a, that's 
a good amount. Okay, I think our demon was already picked up. Yo. Gold, shame, burst, let's go. Have they? Okay, that's a lot of gold from the dwarves. Holy hell, that's a lot of gold. <laughs> okay, so these are fighting each other, which is good for us, you know. I think we're gonna go attack the enemy from be from behind. So the ma the the burn boys, I forget the name, lava lumps, lava lumps. So maybe they stay a little bit longer. No, nope. already all dead. Okay, let's upgrade this. I need to be careful with what I upgrade now because we are limited in what we get. But we want the prison, really. 300. Ah, we can't get the prison. So let's make the snots invisible to the enemy. Let's upgrade. <laughs> Scarcity economy. Let's increase this a little bit. And buy ourselves another imp. Because we need the damage. A so now we pull everyone back in. This appeared oh. to be a profitable target for the unscrupulous evil. Okay, this guy never got the memo to go back home. Just sitting there. I think he wasn't hit by the... Uh, by the spell. By the portal spell. So much gold here. So we can't really work on this yet. Because there's still a little bunch of dwarves who are all pretty darn powerful. Upgrade this. My internal power struggle is strong here. Let's go get that, so we can eventually get Quarry Greystone. And let's go explore a little bit. Ah, uh, well, actually, we don't need to. All that we really need is traps. Traps and mana. Uh, traps and... And evilness is what we need. And we'll just make this... A little bit more painful to go through. And over here, what can we do? Room prices in your dungeon are starting to give birth to a real estate bubble. The danger to the public at large evil considered opening a bad bank. So we could do this, forcing the enemy to walk through the lava. And then we can build like pushers here. So if they walk over there, they get pushed back in. Which is not a complex trap. That's here. So if we build a pusher there and there, like all along this wall here, just to get them. Early on, it helps. Lava doesn't scale very well, though. So definitely, we're going to build a goo trap there. And then just pushers all along here. And then if we take this off and they walk down here, of course it's a little bit shorter. But then we can get them into a thresher. Possibly anyway. If we if we've okay, we're gonna have to go a little bit around here basically. And then we can fill this in. So they don't just One go straight right here. Dug into a lava lump. Oh. Okay. I mean, that's... Oh. I don't want this. 
That's... Even better? <laughs> if they have to go through here? So the snots should be fine, at least the level 4 ones. Oh. So this one is not gonna be fine. Okay, let's try and get those wars here. So we can safely engage with this area. Okay, I hate it. The way they target down here is so bad. They all have to bunch up because they can't see down straight that corridor, you know? So this is obviously ideal for the dwarves and very suboptimal for us because the dwarves just flamethrower us all to death. And they need... they don't need a lot for that either. They don't need a lot. Ding dong, it's payday. Like one flamethrower is basically enough to kill all this whole thing. Let's target him. Alright, very good. So now we have cleared this up. Let's see how much our traps are going to do down there. Probably not too much yet. But now we can start building up here. To get all this lovely gold. Ah, we can't... Can't quarry that yet. So, not really helpful. This here should be decent, though. Only problem, of course, is that we now have lava lumps coming down here. Which we also don't want. So let's spend some more money. And build out those traps here. I think we need a bigger bath. I think they deserve it. I think they deserve a bigger bath. Let's get one more of these in there. And now we're just gonna go attack from down here. While the enemy is still walking our way. And in the tra- oh man. So close, like now it's gonna work, now they're gonna see the wizard. So, as you can tell, the traps aren't really killing anyone of the golden enemies, but they are softening up our enemies for sure. So, let's throw them all here so they can do their payday thing. We're not gonna catch that shipment. But what we could do, because we have the demon thing, we could go and kill some good creatures. Let's go do that. We do extra damage against them, and we do want the evilness. So. Let's go that way. And we have a new amount of imps, so we're gonna set the shortcut again. And we're gonna go attack move this way. And I'm thinking the unicorn shouldn't be much of a problem. But I have been wrong in the past. I sure have been. Let's go. So they're not gonna beguile it, I don't think. Nice. That was a... Quick one, let's upgrade this so we can get the evilness in here. And let's go research some stuff. So, first things first, we're gonna upgrade that. Then we're gonna make the spells 
They're not stronger, it's just mana cost goes down, so that's not... Let's unlock the Infernals first. Let's give... So many big questions right there. We don't have Infernals yet, so upgrading them doesn't help us much. Succubus attacks permanently lower armor. I mean, that's the attack, not the Beguile, so... It's pretty strong. Let's upgrade this thing. We never do. <laughs> we should. Okay, wait, there's... Okay, Lava Lumps. Okay, now let's get back down to fight off the Lava Lumps, because they are getting perilously close to what we... Ideally don't want them to get close to. Let's upgrade that. Traps are a bread and butter of any good dungeon. And you can see there's a big difference already. And they're not gonna die, I don't think. They're gonna survive. Ah. Ah. That's crazy. That's literally like one health point or something. Come on, mess it up. So for that is a problem now. Let's build some more traps this way. And then go get the other good creature on the other end of the map. That's one of those crystal things. I don't like the crystal things. But I think they're actually easier Ding dong, than it's the others. Like, I'll be seeing an army of the enemy approaching behind us. Question is, have we built enough traps to deal with this? The On this side? I'm not so sure. We could still go back. We're we're close enough for that. Question is, should we? Beguiling is on cooldown now, so our army is quite weakened as it stands. And they do have a lot of gold, including a gold healer. So I think... I think we're gonna go back down. They're gonna get... Really a hard hit here, I'm sure, but... Will it be enough for my taste, is the question. And I think the answer will surprise you. In that it is no. We're just gonna go throw our creatures here. Yeah, the healer, that's the problem. That's literally the issue. The traps themselves are pretty good now, but... Those gold healers... They are a tad too strong for my taste. So let's go back up. And let's go... Where did I want to go? Like right there, there were enemies here. I'm gonna do an attack move. Oh, okay. We're gonna do an attack move here, apparently, first. Alright, then. I don't care so much where we kill the enemy. That worked out. So we're gonna go attack move here. Let's see. Do we upgrade our imps? 50% armor ignoring. I do like that, sure. And we have a lot of imps, so that should be a big boost to our damage right off the bat. The 
introduction of social networks into the dungeon resulted in a production loss of over 50%. I think Talia deserves being hit right there. Why is she walking into the tower? Let's just artillery this thing down. We don't really have to walk into the tower, do we? I mean, we could also try and go for some of these... Areas take down some of these buildings, maybe just a little bit scared. Now we do have some beguile. Let's go take care of this. Actually, let's take down all those things first. What are they doing? They are they are getting themselves killed. Look at this. Like, I'm trying to get my army under control, but it seems like they can't shoot across this threshold, even though they're through. Like, that's not the range of the imps, that's... I don't know what's going on there, but they all have to go through the portal, through the gate, despite the gate being destroyed. And we can't... I mean, we might be able to... Will our traps be enough? Okay, we healed up, so let's try this. A shipment of mana set out. This appeared to be a profitable target for the unscrupulous evil. Yep. <laughs> let's get big spells. Let's upgrade this boy and this. And this, and them, for sure. Always the not. And this, so we can get the Infuso mat, which... Honestly, I don't really think we need all that much. Okay, the Lava Lumps were all destroyed. So we can work our way towards the Golden Gate and the shipment, maybe. Our creatures are okay, I think. Ding dong, it's payday. Let's take care of these guys first. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, they are coming from the south. Okay, I think we have time to take care of the enemy in our dungeon and then intercept the shipment still. Maybe. Maybe. Might not go my way. But defending the dungeon, of course, is always a little bit more important than everything else we can do here. Of course, we can add some damage to this. Slow them down even further. But I don't think our traps here are enough. Your gold vein is nearly exhausted. Okay, everyone is down, so now we just go fight them from this end, and I hope this is far enough. Nope. Not the right distance. Okay. Alright. Back up we go. And we'll just go attack move right here, because that place should be cleared out. Big should. Let's get some better doors. A gold vein has been mined out. Oh, we could get this. So, torture chamber. Okay, let's give this some more space here. All this is going to be treasure chamber. All of that. And 
then we put like one door there. <laughs> so we can work on all this gold. So much gold here. Alright, looks like we managed. Very good. So let's fight our way north a little bit. To try and get through there. Imps receive damage over time added to their attack, which makes the target burn for five seconds. I mean... They are our biggest contributor for damage. I know I wanted other things with that, but... Let's get the power imps going. And now let's take care of all this nonsense. Oh yeah, lovely. Okay, that was... Okay, all this is going badly and it's my fault. Entirely my fault. Everything you're seeing right here is absolutely on me. I didn't take the elevation into account. Like, I figured, okay, we can just start bombing that, but... If you don't see what you want to bomb, then you can't bomb it. It's a very simple issue. <laughs> okay, let's try this again. Pull back that gazer. He don't need to die for nothing. Let's try and destroy this without pulling everyone. If we can, then we're gonna do that. Nothing in the dungeon at the moment, so we're good. So that's already helpful. Let's try and take care of this whole area though. Why? Why, Sakyabi? Let's try and pull Talia back. I don't know why the Sakyabi are doing that. I... Maybe they were like, okay, I don't have enough targets to... El beguile over here, so I have to go elsewhere. Maybe. I mean, it worked out fine, but... Gave me a good scare there. I tried to move him, you saw. It was just far too late. If we're being honest. Okay, we have enemies coming in. So let's unlock this before I forget again. Should we upgrade this? Strong room door. Doors regenerate 1% of their health. Broken doors are rebuilt. I mean... Yeah. Let's throw some strong doors around our heart here. Your enemies are in the dungeon. I am quite aware. So let's check I don't forget any statues that might be around here. I tend to. But I think we're good. So we're just gonna teleport down. Or do we I never use the demon portal. Let's use the demon portal. It costs us only mana. Instead of evilness here. Okay, so the lava lumps are all dead. These guys are coming in, so we're just gonna wait a little bit. I have a lot of goo traps there, which is definitely a mistake. I wanted to increase that bath. Let's do it. And now let's build... Uh, 
I mean... Where do we build our... Our hurting chamber? Maybe here. I was so confused where that noise was coming from. Hey, people, please take the priest test. The Thank you. So, of course, we're going to build a big ball. And I wanted to build one of those infusor mats. Maybe we make this bigger. Along down the road. The ambush planning evil quickly developed an interception strategy. I mean we could just go up and do that. Let's Let's try and reach these. There should be nothing in our way, but that tower maybe. So we're gonna go here and see if we can't reach. So how do I get this portal gone? How do I get rid of that portal? Can only be cast in the overworld, okay. Oh no, the unicorn respawned. Well, that puts a little dampener on my plans here. Especially if I don't deal well with the unicorn. And I don't deal well with the unicorn right now. I'm just a little bit too secure in the damage they're dealing. Except they don't... They're not there yet. That's the issue. They're just not there yet. Okay, let's, let's go. Let's bump these numbers here. And now can I get this still? No, it's, it's already through. They already passed here. And there's too much to fight through, so we're just gonna go get this and... And the statue and stuff. Okay, let's see. Evilness. Let's give Talia some room to grow. There's nothing bad in the underworld going on. So now we should be able to do this. Payday. Hmm. Maybe we can catch up to it. That was a destruction. Okay. Can we catch up to it? I mean, if you take the shortcut through the village, which isn't even a shortcut because it just kind of goes in there. Oh, what the heck? What's that? Attackers, invaders. Let's go kill him. Looks good. Yeah, but the shipment is gone. <laughs> and we're not getting that. There are some lavalums trying to get in here. But there's still room for more traps. Okay. I can't upgrade this because we don't have money. Let's help us with the money here. So 
now we can have more evilness vault. Let's upgrade our traps. Full power, full throttle. Succubite damage is increased. Okay, now I need to think again. I'm not born or made to do that. Let's upgrade our uh, gobbler farm because that's a problem right there. I wanted to upgrade the doors fully. Well, let's do that. And that's a good day's work right there. So the lava lumps should definitely die. I'm thinking. Okay. Let's push into this village here. And we'll just add some more power power. And let's build that place. some of these instruments here. Okay, nice work. Let's go through these guys. I like the little goats. They're yelling at us as they run into us. Very cute. Okay. Get this tower safely down. Money is our main problem here, right now, it appears. Well, we're working on it. I do really quite like we see our imps immediately one-shot things, basically. One barrage and something immediately dies. Very satisfying, I must say. Obviously, we will do all these things with the imps. But imagine this mission on hard again. Like... I don't know how I did most of the campaign on hard, I swear. I'm too old for this kind of stuff. Too old by far. Just don't have the mental capacity for it anymore. <laughs> what building is here? It's that. The hero's hall. It's so I think I want some infernals Your next. Your gold is nearly exhausted. Your little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. I bet they have. Okay, what else to upgrade? Since I want some infernals, probably them. Increased range of fire susceptibility is not that important until we have infernals. Let's upgrade this further. Snots to full level. Yep. For sure. Mana consumption during bathing reduced. And let's go for the hero's hall here. And the dwarves that protect it. Oh, the army splits. No, 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 no. It's not good. Let's 
get some magic help in here. Clear out the little things. Tali, I can go to pick this up. Okay, let's get another portal going here. And bring everyone back down for a moment. Because I want to build a new army. Let's get some infernals in there. And they can bathe and all that. And I want to go look for some more gold. I mean, there's some, obviously, but... I can hear the spiders already, so... Oh, there's a lot of gold here. Bet you there's a lot of spiders, too. You don't get this much gold without fighting. Manabors have been discovered in your dungeon. Okay, that's fine. It's immediately engaged Enemies by one of our the amazing defenders. Oh, finally we're getting some attack from up here. This has been a long time coming. I mean, the, the lava is pointless, sadly. All right, let's go. I swallowed one down with a big noisy sound. Four little snots used to work in this room. All right. So that's taken care of. Another big gold vault coming right up. Let's just allow them to dig all this out. Come on. Very good. And we'll give it a vault door because... Gold vault, clearly. So this is what we want to see. We want to see the enemies fighting against these. That's ideal. Just building this out so it gets the full efficiency. Not that it matters much, but here we go. Let's see what's next. This. Does this make him stronger? Improves him, yes. We don't... We want them improved, for sure. Okay, now let's get one of these things here and put it on that. I barely use these. Might want to increase our gobbler farm as well. Let's go do that. Can I? Oh, I can automate these as well. That's cool. I doubt I can automate this. Like a perpetual motion machine? I don't think that's possible. But for the mana, it's very effective. Okay, can I? Oh, I can! Okay, that's funny. I never knew. I think I also never really cared, so... Oh, look at that. All that gold here. I'll have to sell all these. Otherwise, they're gonna start running like crazy to get to that other place. Look at that. Let's upgrade this. Let's give them... Give them more room at home. And we should also probably... Increase capacity per tile. Demon satisfy the need for mana about faster. Increases room efficiency. Mana cost. Let's reduce it. They're all chilling in there. Payday. So why is this stopped? I 
don't really have anywhere to put this. So we're just gonna throw it in the room. Can we only have like three? I also don't know how long these last. Let's build a little roadway here so they don't run entirely nonsensical paths. It's still nonsensical, but it's a little less so. Okay, there's something coming past our demon portal. So we're just gonna go through here and attack this caravan right there. That was very practical for us. I swear, everyone who watched me play through the whole campaign without using stuff like the demon portals, I don't envy you. I'm so sorry about all of that. You guys must have gone mad. With me ignoring certain things the whole time. Such as the demon portal. Well, there you go. Everyone plays these things their own way. Oh, that was just a construction thing? Okay, fine. I don't mind. It's evilness regardless. So there's a house for us to pick. Okay, we need to destroy all the hero buildings, basically. That's our mission. So let's do a little bit for the mission, maybe. Could also destroy that house first. Let's go there first. Let's see about it. And let's upgrade this. So our demons are... Regenerating quicker. And deal 25% more damage is definitely the next thing. Get that statue. You're already there. Pick that up. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay, they're coming from the south, where we have arguably the worst defenses in our whole dungeon. That's okay. We're using the portal now. We're thinking with portals. I'm just gonna get a new portal there. Should we give them a bit more? Damage increased, also do fire damage, yes. Since that's our synergy here, might as well. I know I wanted to upgrade the demons to full. Give all that, but we can do that here. All right, everyone, let's go take care of this. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Here, 25% more damage. Let's go. Level up. Increased range of the fire thing. So these are... Okay, they don't have a healer, so... They should be dying there. Okay, there's also something coming from there. So I think we're just gonna go back down just to be safe. Just to be safe. But yeah, all of these died. I want more traps still. I'm still not super convinced with what we got here in terms of amounts. And we can get another creature. Okay, that thing went nowhere. That should give us some evilness. Okay, what do we need? Another succubus. 
Maybe another infernal. Let's upgrade this. Room's efficiency 50% higher. I like that. Payday. Lots of work being done here. They might not even win against the lava lumps, but... Let's see, let's build this out. And maybe for once we're going to get the complex traps as well. Let's get a bigger gobbler farm, like big. Let's let's put our real human world poultry farming to shame. Let's make this deplorable and then we can build chicken cannons and make it even worse. Horrifying proportions. A few manavores have appeared in your dungeon. That's a good deal with it. But this is a nice mission so far. I'm, I'm enjoying it. Lots of room to build, lots of things going on. But nothing a too overwhelming. Has been unearthed in the dungeon. Okay, listen. Construction crew set out to rebuild the destroyed hero building. Okay. I'm going to take care of that. Manavors have appeared in your dungeon. The absolute evil's creatures are more than a tad upset. Wi-Fi reception in the dungeon is particularly poor today. Could someone be downloading Dungeons 4 from Pirate Bay right now? You wouldn't want that. If you enjoy the game, buy the game. It's a good game. Don't pirate this game. Pirate a lot of other games, but not this one. I have no affiliation. I'm not being paid to say these things. This is just my honest opinion. Okay. So now we got the mass farming. Though I think we could still get some more mass farming here by getting all this. <laughs> Can we speed them up? No, but we could slow them down. Oh, we're gonna thunderclap them. So they fall nice Enemies over. Have entered the dungeon. Throw this at them. Give us a shield. And start fighting through these because they are a problem for sure. A lot of assassins there. I did not agree to that. Okay, cleared that out and the new unicorn has arrived. And these guys are still trying to get past the lava lumps. They might do it. Can we improve this further? Yes. Let's go. So this should be pumping now. Let's increase this. Oh, we also need that. Otherwise, it makes no sense. Capacity per tile up, for sure. Nope. Uh, too late again. At least the second attack didn't go through this time around. I can take some credit here. That's a dead demon. Okay, we're just gonna keep going.
There we go. The farming is happening. So we're going to build ourselves a little pathway along here. For chicken cannons. Manivores have been discovered in your dungeon. Ah, really? A gold vein is almost exhausted. Payday. Okay, let's get that portal here. That is so practical. Come on. Let's get through here. Let's take care of that man of war. Before he becomes an issue. Let's upgrade this. So we get the full level of these. Damage over referring damage increased by 25%. Duration of beguile increases, which is nice. But of course the next level is most important. Improves all spells once more. I mean I like them already. Okay. I think I made some good choices. I hope. <laughs> Okay, chicken cannons along this corridor. So they have a lot of healers. They are gold healers, so it might not be an issue. There's also a platinum or diamond, I'm not sure. Dread. Okay, everything died. <laughs> Even without the chicken cannons, but I like the chicken cannons, so we're gonna do that more. On this side as well. Just alongside here, basically. Just a bunch of chicken cannons. Room efficiency up. I think it's worth it. Let's give this a little bit of an upgrade, huh? We never do. Oh, 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 oh boy. Someone is being very tortured here. That looks ultra painful. Area has been in the <laughs> oh boy. Manivores have been discovered in your dungeon. <laughs> well, let's take care of the mana wars and dig out all the mana. While we're still here, you know? That way our army might be fighting all the little mana wars popping up immediately. Could increase the size of this as well. Alright, let's go. I just want these in little compartments because I think it's cute. That's why I'm pulling in some walls again. Could use another bit of mana vault, honestly. So I'm just gonna put that here. Get some doors going. 
Our enemies are in the dungeon. They're coming from this side. Okay. It's fine. Okay, our industrial farming here is going well. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I've never had this many gobblers. Ever. This is all very silly. Let's increase efficiency of this even further. And capacity per tile go up. This is some crazy stuff. These are still automated. We can't automate them more. Our chicken cannons are still not built fully, all over. Still a lot to be done. They might actually die just to the basic traps here. So these things should be pumping again. They are not, because they can't pump into this room. Okay. So we need one of those things in here. So it can pump into that room. Let's make it bigger then. Give it all the room we can give it. Okay, I think none of the enemies made it through. Time for us to go... What is the opposite of spelunking? When you go into the overworld and do things there. Well, that's what we're gonna do. Let's go. Let's fight us through some stuff, get some more things. Do you have any idea how little they pay me to do this gig? I'll be happy if it's enough to pay for the bus ticket home. How long has this been going? Almost two hours. So basic enemies are just... Chaff before the wind at this point. Just slice through them. Let's pick up that evilness. And increase this capacity per tile. More mana our way. And I'm getting a stiff neck. I'm not sure why. Oh. It's all that winning that we are doing here. Should probably go look for some more gold, huh? Let's go dig in weird directions. You can always just go back home. That spell is crazy. By now, anyway. Well taken care of. I need to drink something as well. That's what these very long missions get you, Thirsty. Very good, very good. Your little snots have dug into a spider nest. Well, is it a spider nest or is it just spiders? It's just spiders. Don't lie to me. Build a vault door in there. Just to be on the safe side. And now we're just gonna bust into this little dwelling here. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oh, yeah. Well, the chicken cannons are slowly building up here, so... They'll have a tough time trying to get through our defenses. A mana shipment was underway. 
If it were to reach oh, yeah. its destination, it would surely strengthen the hero's position. If it were to reach its destination. I mean, the mana shield is fully gone, but I don't think we can reach that shipment down there. They, they're going to get through there. What happens if we have troops down here when the mana shield reactivates? I haven't never even looked exactly on where that is. Okay. I'll just keep fighting our way through places here. Let's see, can I just get this with my imps? This specifically here, I don't want to run into that. Nope. It's not working. They can't see through this. It's, it's, it's very silly, I must say. It's very silly. Extremely silly, one might say. Okay, our enemies in the dungeon are completely obliterated, as is to be expected. With our fantastic shooting gallery here. <laughs> These skirmish missions, they feel like they give you a little bit more room. And what to do with your time. And a pure obliterate everything mission, I like it. It's, uh, it's a nice change of pace here. Let's see, who or what can we upgrade? Simple spells, even less mana. Room capacity, let's give them more levels here so we can get the Sakibai full. Upgraded, let's go here. Let's just really pump this stuff. That's the spiders. Ooh, look at that. Nice. Kind of vanishes in our mega vaults, but that's okay. Let's help out a little bit. I really like that spell, if you can't tell. Reminds me a lot of black and white. That god game. Oh, it was janky as heck, but those were those were some fun games. Ballista Tower, okay. It's good because it also throws enemies to the ground. It's not just damage. Like, it's basically Thunderclap and damage combined. I think Thunderclap does deal damage, but... Just not quite as much. going weird ways. I should have taken this at some point, but it's okay. Again, we have to walk through the... I mean, at least both sides need to walk through. Like, neither side can see through it, it appears. So if it's fair in that way, you know, then I'm, then I'm good with it. If it's only someone has to do it and the other side just gets a pass, then, then that sucks. I don't like that. Let's free up our snots here. I wish we could just designate places that they are supposed to go and refill them with those automatic things. <laughs> so much gold. So much treasure. Let's see, what can we do for them? I mean, this is important to upgrade before you ever build it, because the pylons are very expensive with evilness. And it is a rare resource to a point. 
So we'll take this and then we go north. Now we're just rampaging. Now we are to a point unstoppable. <laughs> Look at this! <laughs> oh my god. I love it. That's fantastic. No one even got hurt. Okay, so we're just gonna give attack move up there. They'll deal with it. They don't need me for that. Let's upgrade this fully. Upgrade this fully so Talia can get level 10. And then let's start building some power pylons. I think. Maybe here. I need a lot of space, so... Is that enough or two? Enemies Almost, but not quite. I say let them. Let them enter the dungeon. Oop. Not exactly what I wanted. Cute. They're actually taking a little bit of damage. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can we just leave evilness on the table like that? Are we that powerful already? I feel we might be. A little snot is secretly making jokes about the absolute evil behind its back. It should be punished, but I forgot which one it was. They just all look the same. I don't know. I don't think that needs punishment. We run a free speech dungeon here. So these guys are still dealing with the lava. Still trying to get places. That's actually much more effective than I figured it would be. Thresher has a... Oh, he has chargers, still. So he's gonna throw a few people around. <laughs> ah, let's just push through here. I think we're nicely regenerated now. And we got one pylon of power already. So they can level up beyond level 10 now. Which is nice. Your gold vein is nearly exhausted. Uh oh, please don't crash game. Oh, please don't crash right now. I don't know when the last autosave was. Oh, no. Oh, no, it, it crashed. Oh. Ah, the pains. The pains. No, why are you crashing? Okay, let's figure out where the... Oh. Let's start the game again. <laughs> let's see. Let's see how far we have to go. Ah, boy. Okay, so people voted that I keep the things in that go wrong in the game. This, to me, is a thing that goes wrong in the game. So let me... Welcome back, hero <sighs> torturing evil. Oh, God. One hour and 29. That's like... 30 minutes lost. Which is weird because the interval for autosaves is 15 minutes. I don't know exactly how that works. Oh god, look at the map. It's all still there. We haven't built a power pylon yet. <laughs> ah. Pains. It's pains. Payday. All the pains. Oh, goodness. My heart.
That's a hard one. That's a tough one. Oh, <laughs> look at all the research. <laughs> no. All right, okay. Let's go. Let's push through here. Let's try our luck. Let's get big mana rooms as well. Had we started on... Okay, this is definitely going. Let's get big mana rooms. All this here, mana room. All this mana bolt. All of that. I would just literally push it through here. Mana bolt efficiency up. This time we're gonna get this first. So with demons, I think you can rest a little bit easier on giving them attack commands, attack move commands, because they regenerate. So you're not that bad off if they encounter something and then they keep going. I'll just heal between, basically. I'd like to pick this up, though. Still need to pump those numbers. Why? 500. Okay, almost. I'm not gonna buy anything until we can do that, then. But we can use mana for sure. Okay, let's go mana vault. this and since the vault it gets vault doors <laughs> it gets a oh okay that is a little bit bigger at this point in time a mana shipment was on its way to deliver the volatile energy to its destination. These are dying a little bit the slow for my taste. Evil did not prevent it from doing so. We're actually losing creatures, aren't we? No. Alright, we're just gonna wait in here in that burst of flames. Gonna give us a new little portal there. Alright, this is working fairly well. So let's take care of the oh god, there's so many dwarves here. That we have to pull back. Pull back. Let's upgrade so they can get higher levels and we're gonna get Gorgu in here because the dwarves are just too tanky for what we got I 
Like, that's not going well for us it's without Gorgu. Day. And Gorgu, of course, like, he just obliterates this. So let's see. We'll just send him down there to attack that. And we are also now we're gonna go there to attack that. So Gorgo goes his own way now. Succubi full level, this full level. He don't care. He just powers through. And see, I'm waiting for these to be built so we can throw some automated battery thingies on them. Let's see if Gorgu is gonna reach one of those buildings. Can I auto save? Can I save with F5? Yep. I should be doing this a bunch. I'm scared now. It has. I don't think I've seen that kind of crash before. During the whole playthrough of the campaign, I haven't seen that. So that's a big shame, but stuff happens. Can I have? Okay, I, I can have multiple on the hand. Are these built yet? No. Let's give them max level. Upgrade this thing. A construction crew was on its way to repair and rebuild the destroyed hero structures. Did Talia die? No. We're looking at where Talia is. Okay, let's go there then. Let's try and prevent this. For a second Talia died, I thought. automate these things because they are also much more efficient like you can see they're working much much faster than the snots do I'll just go there and hope that the good being isn't Exactly resurrected at the very same time we end up here. Oh boy. There was just a lot of assassins. That scared me. That's why I threw all that m magic on them. Okay, good taken care of. So next we go here. Ah, we're just gonna save a bunch. <laughs> okay, our gold reserves are going down a little bit. Our gobbler reserves are not. 1,000 gobblers. That is silly. That is very silly. Let's give this some more room. Your enemies are in the dungeon. I bet. So our main army is doing fine. Just smashing through everything. Rumor has it that work is already underway on a free-to-play sequel called Clash of Dungeons, a soulless pay-to-win click game designed to suck the money out of your wallet. 
<laughs> that was a joke. As if Realmforge could actually make a mobile game. I mean, weirder things have happened. Let's go spend some it's of that payday. money. Let's just have a lot of everything. Let's get some more of these. And some more of this. All of these are automated, 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 automated. And these are all dead. As befits their station. Let's see we take care of that. Let's go take care of this. Let's give Talia a chance at level 10. Upgrade this, upgrade that. So fully automated automation. Nice. So what do we need still money? Any money. I think we were going this way last time when we got interrupted. Very rudely. Oh boy, there's a lot of enemies here. They're all kind of weak, so. Not so bad. I don't think. Should be fine. Manavors have appeared in your dungeon. Okay, that of course we don't like, but that gives us an opportunity to buy some more demons here. Recruit for our army some more. Just picking up that evilness there. Your little snots have dug up a spider. Let's pump that throne room. And maybe these? Just so we get a prison? Where could we put a prison? <laughs> it's, it's just so many. Let's let's turn this into a prison. So they can oh okay, wait. There's gold there. Your little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. A few manivores have appeared in your dungeon. Mm -hmm. Let's turn that off. So where's that manivore? Your little snots have dug into a spider nest. Let's sell this. Okay. All right then. Let's fill this up and stop digging there, and let's get prison going here. And this doesn't need the big doors. One of your little snots dug into a lava lump. Okay, that could be a bigger problem. Lava lumps tend to come with a... They tend to come with a portal. Let's check. No portal. So these are not active. These are not going to attack us. That's nice. That's nice of them. Okay, let's take down Frogo. Frogo is a little bit confused. Okay. Let's go push this so we can upgrade the 
this and I don't really want to get more than the prison out of this. Honestly. It's really all I'm looking for. I'm not even gonna go for that statue because we have enough evilness for everything. Kinda wanna go down and take care of these things, but... At the same time... <laughs> look at it, it's beautiful. It's perfect. Maybe that's what uh, crashed the game earlier. Maybe that's what's what did it. It's payday. Of course it's only attacking my people, not his own. The tower is smarter than everyone. The tower knows what's up. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Okay, I think I wanna go down and clear out everything a little bit. A construction crew set out to restore the shattered hero buildings. I mean, we, we have our portal right next to it, so... I don't worry too much. And we're just here to clear out all this nonsense here. Let's build that power place. Because we are a little bit on low on gold. We need to find a new gold source. Last time I think we did a little bit better with the gold. I'm not quite sure how. Let's dig all the random gold bits up that are still here. There is quite a bit of gold lying around for no good reason, so... Might as well get that. Lava lumps. Yeah, the chicken cannon just... They don't do all that much. But it's funny. So that's all that matters. Funny. Okay, why are the spiders attacking my door? That's unacceptable. Let's take care of that. And let's dig. Dig. God, there's so much to dig through. And let's dig. There's some gold there. Let's put like a little treasure chamber here. Manivores have been discovered in Not your much. dungeon. We can have more creatures, by the way, so. I think more firepower would be good. Room. Oh. Okay, that's extensive. That's something. That's a lot for us to deal with. But deal with it, we shall. Let's throw us some help. I bet you all these are manual again. So let's use our large stores of energy and get all this automated again. Okay, this is gonna take us a moment, a hot second. To clear up. And we're losing a bunch of demons too. Okay, could we please everyone agree on attacking this? Okay, lava lumps are fighting spiders. I can dig it. Your little snots have dug into a spider nest. 
A few manivores have appeared in your dungeon. Lava Lump versus Spiders. Who's gonna win? And now Lava Lump against us. Who's gonna win? Hopefully we know the answer to that question. And it's us. Let's, let's pull together so we don't fighting on two fronts here. Oh, goodness. Okay, that's not even funny. <laughs> the slow button pushing evil was taking its time with building its dungeon. So much time that even the undead thought, dude. Okay. All right, I hear you. I just gotta clean up like eight million spiders now. I mean we could we could go here. Could go through there. Somewhere. Maybe. There. And force our enemies to walk through here. So just basically fill that in. Enemies are in the dungeon. Oh, goodness. I think we might benefit from a pit fiend. Might just. Maybe don't die randomly in random places, you fools. Maybe don't do that. Oh god. There's so much... ...enemies. So, so many of them. Now I'm not earning evilness like crazy anymore. Because these don't give us any evilness, sadly. Okay, everyone please do your payday thing. You have discovered lava <laughs> Oh god no. Let's take care of these first, maybe. Let's thunderclap that. Really trying to push through here, but... Okay. How about we kill the portal too? Hmm? How about you all die trying to kill that portal, huh? I'm not sure if it's a sacrifice I'm willing to make, but there we go. Okay, we're gonna go take care of these spider nests here. Because these spiders and these lava lumps are kind of fighting, so we should be good on that front. But all these spider nests here are still portals into our realm, basically. So... Where was that on the other nest? There. Gotta take care of that first. First? Our enemies are getting nice and killed. We like to see it. And since they're dying in our dungeons, we do get evilness out of them after all, which is also very nice. So now we're gonna roll up the spiders from behind, kinda. So we're just gonna drop somewhere in here. Throw us some fire down. 
Like so, and some thunder clapping. And some shielding. And some big inferno. And some more fire dropping from the sky. Everything is, yeah, everyone is fine and dandy. These guys are a little bit dead though. No one's bringing them evilness, however, to resurrect them. Oh boy. Okay, let's... They fight units first, which makes sense, but... We need to take care of those nests as well. Like we can't just go through here and kill everything. We have to actually take care of those nests. Otherwise, this will be a futile exercise. How is there a one spider? Oh god. Oh god, god. Oh god. Okay, let's try this again. Pull everyone together. Well, we can throw this somewhere. Are in the dungeon. There was another one on an island or something. So the succubi, while being really good creatures, are also kind of annoying because they keep wandering off to find new things they can succubi, so... Let's get some more infernals. They are a little bit more... Intelligent. Oh no. Okay, the lava lumps are almost through everything. Let's go mess them up first. Give us a little leg up. That is absolutely not what I expected to do now. That game crash really changed the whole dynamic of everything down here. Oh man. Let's see, these are manual again, we don't like that. Let's go automate. Anything that needs automating? No, nope, we're good. Everything is running on auto. A mana shipment was underway. If it were to reach its destination, it would surely strengthen the hero's position. If it were to reach its destination. I mean, that would be a nice thing to get. That would be a very nice thing to get because it's kind of close to our entrance anyway. But I'm slightly worried with all these creatures here. I mean, look at that. They're killing the mana balls for sure, but... They're also just skittering right down to where we live. Which we don't like, as you might imagine. Okay, so we cleared all that out. I, I, I don't even know where these spiders just came from. Let's give our snot some work to do. The heroes are not a problem anymore. Whatsoever. This is all spider world. That's our problem. <laughs> Let's see. Can we upgrade this? Room efficiency higher. Which I hope means more evilness, but I'm not quite sure.
Let's build some ways through here. So the little snots have completely mined out a gold vein. The enemies can see all the all the little creatures. They don't get to eat. And down here, I just want to have a quicker way over from there to there for depositing items generated from the prison. Micro pigs are entering your dungeon. However, they're so small you can't even see them. We're almost done clearing out all those spiders. But we absolutely have to, like, we cannot go upstairs while this is happening down here. No way, no how. Payday. The enemy is coming past our demon gate, so we still have a chance to intercept that thing. Okay. Just a few more spiders and spider nests, and we can have peace again in the realm. Let's just throw that in there for no good reason. Except that we have the room. Okay, last. Why is this still a thing? Well, let's go fight these guys too. I don't trust them. They look shifty. Nice, the doors are regenerating almost faster than the spiders can get through. Okay, we dealt with this. Now let's deal with the last remnants of spiders. I don't know why this is still here. But there is for sure lots of gold here. So that little issue is now resolved as well. I mean, look at that. Construction crew set out to restore the shattered hero buildings. Okay, let's go take care of all these things. They're coming past our demon gate. And we're safe and sound again. And just fight these while we wait. So we're just gonna go here. They cross there. Maybe we can catch them there. Let's see, what do we need to upgrade? This. So we can get this to max level. Heroes are teleported to the prison upon being defeated. That's amazing. That frees up our little schnots. Your enemies are in the dungeon. Yeah, we don't worry about that anymore. <laughs> that is literally not a problem. All right. And now we get just push against those because there is a thing we need to destroy here anyway. Might as well. Whew. I'm scared, so I'm going to press F5. Let's get that saving up. <laughs> All right. Let's fill this out. I mean, it's so much gold here. Not that they needed the support, but might as well give it. Let's see what else can we research. Let's just pump our dungeon heart with defenses. I never put that max. Mm. 
let's get everything researched here. Just because we can. I don't know if there's an achievement to have everything on level 10. But this might be the mission where we can actually manage that. Okay, let's go down here. Keep pushing. They have this little exclamation mark here, which I don't know exactly what that means, but... Probably nothing good for me. And we're looking out for number one here, which is us. Still no one is helping these guys. Okay, now it's happening. Ooh, ooh. Not good. There's a lot of dead demons there all of a sudden. Let's bring in our friend Gorgu. Like, there's a lot of healing going on back there. We don't like that. Yeah, that's too much healing for us. are collecting their pay let's save that oh no what are you doing attack Maybe the exclamation mark was, this place is dangerous. Because, to be quite honest, it actually is. Okay, Gorgu, uh, let's let's go that way. See what you can do. While we still have him. Let's pump the faction research just full up, why not? So... Do we get that thing? I think, yeah. We still got the Pit Fiend. I don't exactly know how to dismiss him. Oh, just clicking again does it. There you go. Learn something new again. And time for more automation. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Let's see, everything is nice and automated. We got another power pile and going. We very much obliterated this place. So we go pick that up. Do we unlock anything here? Now we're just gonna go for a faction research as high as we can. Okay, that's high. <laughs> but it's still only gonna be demons. A full demon army here. So let's get some more damage in. <laughs> I am very amused. I don't think I've ever had such a big army. That is so cool. Okay, let's go push. Might lose a few newly rec recruited creatures there. Okay, let's stick together. At least let's stick together. Let's try and not make it worse than it needs to be.
So the level up should be very swift. Because the strong enemies are really giving a lot of experience points. Which is nice. Level 10, everything level 10. So we can have one more creature. A whole one. Oh, okay. Alright. So we're gonna get ourselves a little portal. Some people Am I gonna go home? Isn't ready for release yet, but I say that is a release with hair on its chest. <laughs> to kill these two. <laughs> we just have a lot of everything. A whole lot of everything. Okay, let's go back up through the portal. Oh wait, no. We have one more creature we can have. What shall it be? Yeah, 20 imps. The Impra has his imp army now. Okay, let me select all those imps. And we have to get here somehow. Let's see if the army splits. No, it does not. Okay, we're just gonna let them come out while we literally pick up the evilness and then we're gonna go fight them. So I'm working on finishing the mission. This is my current goal. Let's just finish up the mission. And while we do that, we're just gonna research things. So whatever we can research, we're just gonna go. Take it. But of course, I'm very happy with our nice large army. The destruction they bring. So good. I mean, the tower got over a shot. It's fair. Let's see, let's get this bit. And then we'll clean up the center. Just upgrading whatever. We could, of course, get like a brewery and build some beer cannons and stuff, but... I'm not gonna do anything sensible anymore. I'm just going through here. Getting places. It's still working here. There's a lot to do. These are all low level, so this should immediately kill them all. <laughs> Enemies have entered the dungeon. Oh no! How terrible! It's so nice when you're overpowered, honestly. I like it when games allow you to do that. When they don't scale difficulty and stuff. It's just... Always feels wrong. Like, what did I work for? What did I work so hard for if you're just scaling difficulty? I want to feel overpowered. Oh, that's very mean. <laughs> Problem, of course, is that our imps right now are kind of falling apart from the rest of the army. So I would like that to stop. <laughs> okay, everyone, please go here. Let's just try and keep together. All the mana, all the gold. I 
I really wish there was something to generate evilness with your creatures. That doesn't rely on enemies, you know? So technically, I know there is. Was underway. If it were to reach its destination, it would surely strengthen the hero's position. If it were to reach its destination. Well, it will, because I don't really have a way to get down there any anytime soon, so... That's fine, though. We don't mind. We're just finishing up. Just getting this done. Could get ourselves a pit fiend up here. Just to really complete the army. Might as well. We definitely generate enough to be able to afford the upkeep there. And now let's get Gorgu in here as well. So now we have everything going. And we'll throw him alone down here. No achievement for having a full army, a pit fiend and Gorgu. All right, let's follow the kid and save again because I'm not doing this hey once day. more. I am very much done. Even though the mission doesn't know it yet, but I am done. I have won. The mission is finished. I even like that Gorgu is so crazy overpowered. It's just a kind of get out of jail free card. When you need it. He's there for you. He got you. Okay, very good, very good. Last Tanya building, we're done. Successfully destroyed the hero city and all its nice. camps. Bravo. Oof. And we got creature move 20% faster on the overall. Given the very few things we can select, like this is not a great one. <laughs> Not really, especially with the uh, speed potions and stuff, so. But we did it. Boy, howdy, did it take a while with a crash in between, but we agreed. We're not cutting anything out. It is what it is. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, maybe do that. Also, check out the Twitch. Crusader Kings mainly, but other things as well. And I thank you so much for being here. And... Hope to see you around next time. Until then, bye-bye.